Releasing tomorrow, October 8th, we have Billy from the Saw series. Wanna play a game? A big, big thank you to Epic Games for Billy here. I have seen quite a few of the Saw movies. Um, not my favorite, but I have seen them. Billy and the outfit are 1500 V-Bucks, reactive to eliminations. You can see the animation here. Um, you won't see it as the user, you're just gonna see the hair. But the backlink reactivity with elims, you will have a sound play in game and get the animation as well here, which is, there it is. I wanna play a game. Harvesting tool, 800 V-Bucks. Sounds pretty scary-ish. Pretty scary-ish, traversal emote. Billy's tricycle, 500 V-Bucks. The weapon wrap, animated, not reactive, comes in at 500 V-Bucks. Now, there is a rumor, there is a bundle for all of this I'm showing you in this video, but I was not given that information. My apologies. With that being said, let's play a game. I'm not sure if I told you guys, but there is no Lego for Billy. I guess it's too spooky. Ooh, spooky. For Lego to have that included here. But, um, a little bit of hair physics, I will give it that. A little bit of hair physics there. Not too much though. Equip when equip. I, I don't think it's gonna have anything crazy for animations here. It sounds it sounds decent. I'll say that. But we we already have saw tools in the game that might have more to offer visually. I don't know. I guess it makes sense for a tool, but it could have been a number of things considering all of the traps in the Saw movies. It seems like they went kind of safe here with the harvesting tool. Maybe that's just me. And if this does actually pertain to a specific thing in the movie that I don't remember, I mean, Saw, Jigsaw, like I get it, but I don't know. So the back wing is reactive to Elims the outfit as well, but you will not see the reactivity of the outfit from my POV. I'm gonna try to go into replay and show it to you guys here, but here we go. So you saw the animation with the TV there. I'm gonna use a weapon now and do the same thing. Ooh, it showed up again. Okay. So weapon wrap appears to be okay. Animation's not bad here. I'm not super excited about it. Again, it's not reactive, just animated here. On a larger scale. It looks okay. Obviously it matches that green color tone within the TV screen. So that makes sense here. I'm digging the shoes, man. I mean, can we just look at the shoes real quick? The shoes are fire. Now the traversal emote. <laughs> goes very, very slow. It is called Billy's Tricycle. Unfortunately, when you turn, you don't get any movement really from, well, you do get a slight turn of the front wheel. It's very subtle, I think, but it does kind of turn, or it could just be me. It just goes back and forth, it looks like. So it doesn't turn depending on the direction you're going there as the user. So I just noticed something here with the traversal emote. I was trying to get a thumbnail and you can actually just sit still on the tricycle. And then once you move and pedal, you actually get the giggles. And it also looks like there might be a little bit of blood on the tire as well. And also the back thing looks like it just kind of randomly shows the face every now and then. Okay. For the glider though, I thought it might be kind of fun because there's a lot of people getting hurt in Saw movies. We have the Ecto Glider. I know it's a little bizarre. A lot going on here, but it's like an ambulance in a sense, okay? So I think it makes sense. I do want to take off the back thing real quick. I don't think the hair physics are going to change here, but I do want to try that very quickly. Yeah, I don't think anything really changed here, but just to show you guys that there is no sound for the reactivity for the outfit. Nada. I wanted to show you the weapon wrap on the Surge Dial Cosmetics. 
I think the blades look a little corny right now, but I think the animation behind the blades looks pretty cool. And then during the day as well. Yeah, I think it looks better on the weapon. It didn't look terrible on the golf cart here, but we don't even have those in the game. But I will say, um, not, not terrible with the wrap, not terrible. Combos on Billy, a lot of potential here. This looks like a trap. This is the antidote that the victim needs to get the poison out. This goes with the bow tie that Billy is wearing. This also looks like a trap. Ravenpool's cage in the color scheme is perfect. This is also the antidote that they need to, you know, stay alive. I believe there's a bat involved in the Saw series with like nails or spikes or something like that. This could insinuate the timer until the trap goes off. That's a stretch. My music just ended as well. That's kind of embarrassing. Channel 6 news camera because he does watch his victims while they're trying to escape. The chair. Just imagine it's a very spooky trap chair, okay? Chain cape. Chains are involved in some of the traps for sure. Boomstick. The cop does set off the trap in the first Saw movie. Blood Moon Rising. Ooh, spooky. Ooh, spooky. Dark Grasp. Also a spooky combo. This is more of a color scheme. Not really all that great. This one's fun. Spooky combo. Nice colors. This one. Oh, no. I'm in a trap. Help me. I thought it was fun to use the animation for that. Or the... Uh, the emotion for that pumpkin. The spikes, spikes are involved. Lil Nashi kind of looks like Billy here. Kind of does. Timekeeper to insinuate the time until the trap goes off. The strong box, the guy that has the candle has to get the codes to um, unlock the antidote inside to survive. Stabilizer should not be here. I don't know why it's favored in my apologies. Spike satchel is more of a color scheme, but the spikes kind of make sense. This is a saw, right? It's pretty close to a saw in terms of the blade teeth there, saw blade. Um, ooh, spooky. No ghost, please. This kind of looks like a trap with the TomCom. It kind of does. This is the serum, or serum? Serum. They need to get the poison out of them. This is what it came with. Trapper pack. I will believe the darker version will look better here. Yep, it does look better. Trappy for obvious reasons. I don't even have to tell you why. That's great. Now, I had this favorited before I got the cosmetics. I knew that this was coming out, but I wanted to use a TV, but we actually got a TV for the outfit anyways. Um, this kind of looks like a trap you could put on someone's head. I'm just saying, and the color scheme is perfect. And then winged cavalry. Um, the razor wire, I'm, I'm kind of stretching like one of the traps there with the blades and the wire, and they have to push their face through it. Anyways, a lot of combo potential. Potential? <laughs> with Billy here. So much potential. They nailed it out of the park. 10 out of 10. Would recommend. And with that being said, this releases tomorrow, October 8th, at the item shop reset. Please, please, please. Use someone's code as supported creator minus P-I-Z-0-P-Z with the zero. And we'll see you on the live stream. See ya.